Hi, today I'd like to talk about risk adjustment data validation. What is it and why do you need to understand it? CMS oversight of Medicare Advantage programs is directed toward, one, ensuring diagnosis coding is being done correctly, two, ensuring that fraud and abuse are not being committed, and three, ensuring that patients are receiving services that meet the standards set by CMS. Risk adjustment data validation is the way CMS addresses one and two. The five-star quality rating system is used to address number three. We'll discuss this in the next video. Correcting coding and fraud and other abuses are identified through risk-adjusted data validation audits. Risk-adjusted data validation audits are the way CMS recoups improper payments. The Medicare Advantage organization selected for a risk adjustment data validation audit will be asked for medical records of patient encounters. The medical records will be reviewed to ensure that there are specific links to HCCs and diagnosis codes in the medical record. If the coded diagnosis code or codes are found to be invalid, CMS will then take the error rate found in the medical records and use an extrapolation formula to determine the payment error for the Medicare Advantage contract. This can easily result in CMS demanding a refund of millions of dollars from the Medicare Advantage organization. For this reason, the Medicare Advantage organization is very interested in making sure that participating physicians are documenting the medical record correctly and coders are coding accurately to reflect what is in the medical record. You do not want your medical records to be subject to a risk-adjusted data validation audit. But if they are, you will want them to have no or a minimal number of errors. If your medical records and coding result in a Medicare Advantage organization refunding millions to CMS, the Medicare Advantage organization will claw back a chunk of money from you and your practice, then terminate you from their panels. If the abuses in your medical records are significant, CMS may expel you from participating in Medicare and Medicaid in the future. The liabilities can be significant. So that is what a risk-adjusted data validation audit is. I hope this helps. Have a good day.